Morphe time! Dragon Zord! What's up? What's up, what's up? What's up? Savage Sir! Your Bonsai! Heavyweight! Champion! Your Shogun! Champion! Your Evolution Tag Champion! What's up? What's up? What's up? Dragon Sword, come on! Go, go, Savage Sam! Power down! Who? What a battle! What a battle indeed! What a battle indeed! What's up? 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 What's up, 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 Translating from Wazupian to English was just your Baltimore Tarzan boy ask um song ba from Baltimore Tarzan boy. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Anywho. A anywho, let's kick things off. Now, let's go right into Ace Bradford. Ace Bradford here, Ace is on the case. Now with me now. Now with me now. Mm. Now with me now. Mm. Yeah. Hold on. Brett Towers here. And it's been a while. It's been a while. Brett Towers was on a roll. Then had a match against a new developmental wrestler, Corbin Bundy. And Corbin Bundy got the best of Brett Towers. Well, Corbin Bundy, at the next show, episode 1736, it's me and you again, boy. Corbin Bundy versus Brett Towers. 
and you don't have a tower of a chance when I lock in that tower lock, that sharpshooter to tap you out. Son, Brett Towers is coming back, coming back strong and will beat Corbin Bundy by submission. Hopefully. Back to Ace. Now with me now. Now with me now. Now with me now. Savage Sam. Let's get down to business. At Stardom Saga 26, it will be Bailey versus Danielle Dynamite in a two out of three falls. A two out of three falls. So it can to spice their feud up. Good luck, girls. Good luck indeed. May the better May the better women win. Also on docket. You will see. Number one contender for the Astral Core title. Behemoth versus Roman Reigns, who is no stranger to holding the Astral Core Championship. Versus Eclipse. Or Midnight Four as they once called them. Or are still called. You will see. Hydro Hero and Walter Whirlpool take on Otis and Tucker Knight Heavy Machinery in a number one contender for the Shadowweight Tag Titles. ESW Shadowweight Tag Titles to be exact. Who are the Midnight, Midnight Boys? Midnight 2 and Midnight 3. Now wait a minute. Hold on a second. Wait a minute. Hold on a second. I got breaking news. Uh, midnight boys! You thought you could get <coughs> You thought you could get rid of old your old pal Goldar? No sorry! <coughs> Gold are here and gold are <coughs> sorry. Gold are here and I am going to find in this universe another tag team partner and I'm joining this number one contendership for the ESW. Shadow what eight tag team championship number one contendership <sighs> Midnight boys are going down you can't take a gold arm down without a fight another fight cause I'm the winner this number one contendership <sighs> You can't keep old Goldie down. Goldie are down. Uh, midnight boys. Uh, you'll wait and see to see who. You're going to have to watch the number one contendership to see who old Goldie found as our tag team partner. Uh, midnight boys. <coughs> Goldar needs to get some water. <sighs> wow. Goldar had a lot to say. <laughs> so Goldar is in, in has it just in, added himself, inserted himself to this number one contender for the ESW Shadowweight Tag Team Championship match. We'll have to wait and see who is Goldar's partner. Also on the docket, you know, 1737, 
Banzai Heavyweight Championship Main Event Rematch, Savage Sam. That's me. Of course. Hold on. Of course. Rematch against MVP. And I'm not losing this belt, MVP. It's mine, Charlie. It's mine. No, not the chocolate. No. The Bonsai Heavyweight Championship is mine, son. Slippers, Ace. Oh, wait. Wrong video. Slippers, Ace. Ace, how many times did I tell you? Wrong video. And you still didn't get my slippers. Anywho. Anywho. We got an announcement. At 1737, the first match has been announced. It will be a four-way. Number one contender for the Dark Horse World Championship. And it will be Tommy End versus Buddy Murphy versus Alexander Wolf versus Wesley Blake in a four-way elimination match. And the winner gets to go against the Dark Horse World Champion himself, Austin Theory. Let's hear from Austin Theory. Ah, four guys. Tommy End. Buddy Murphy. Who also calls himself the best kept secret. Alexander Wolf was a tough opponent. I already fought him once and retained my belt, but it, it was a lot to retain against Alexander Wolf and Wesley Blake. Here's the theory the Austin theory. No matter how many people are in this match, no many how many people is, uh, I'm going against. One-on-one, -on -one, triple threat, fatal four-way, five-way, six-way, um, battle royal, rumble, Austin Theory is winning, retaining. I didn't win the World Title Summit 1, where all the world champions fought. I didn't win. Wait. Hold on, hold that theory. I did win. I did win the World Title Summit. Beating all the world champions. From superstars to ESW. To ESW to SAW. And all the other SAW World Champions. There are more than one world title on the SAW show. Including the newly made Banzai Heavyweight Championship. I didn't win the I did win the world title summit meaning it must mean I must be gifted it must mean Austin Theory is on a higher level than any of the world championships in SAW, SCW, GCW era, superstars, you name it. Maybe. I have a chip on my shoulder. I mean, I mean, I didn't. I mean, the proof is in the pudding. I'm still your Dark Horse World Champion. And I'm still gonna going to be your Dark Horse World Champion. Austin Theory. The theory is... Bring your A-game, or else Austin Theory is going to win. Theory, out. Wow. Confidence is key.
But backing it up always still means something too. He did win the World Title Summit. And he has been defending it. We'll have to wait and see. One, who he's fighting. And two, does he retain against whoever he fights? Now with me now. Still Savage Sal here. Tommy End. <sighs> Tommy End here. And the end is near for Austin Theory. When I knock him out. Well, first go through the other three. And then knock him out with with my martial arts. The end is near for Austin Theory. When I show him that his theory can be can be fought. When I hit him with the nightmare kick. <laughs> he won't see it coming. And then Tommy End is your new Dark Horse World Champion. Tommy out. Wow. Now with me now, Buddy Murphy. Hey man, it's your old pal Buddy Murphy. And I am your best kept secret. And Buddy Murphy is going to defy the odds because he only has a one in fourth chance of winning the elimination number one contender for the Dark Horse World Championship. And then Buddy Murphy will sky high all the way to start from Saga 26 and to win, hopefully win, the Dark Horse World Championship. Buddy Murphy, Murphy, out. Now with me now, Alexander Wolf. <sighs> Sorry about that. Austin Theory, you got the best of me, but I'm going to get the best of you, but first, I got to go through Tommy and Buddy Murphy and Wesley Boink, and then I get my second crack at you, and this time, the secret's out, oh, sorry, Sorry, Buddy Murphy. I didn't mean to spill the secrets. I'm winning the Dark Horse World Championship. Alexander Wolf is winning the Dark Horse World Championship. Wolf out. Now with me now, Wesley Blake. Why do I need to do this? Why do I need to have promo time? I don't need it. Just, just dub me the winner. Dub me the winner of this Fatal 4-Way. These three don't have a chance against Wesley Blake. No. And then just when it comes to starting with Saga 26, just hand me the belt, Austin Theory. I'll save you the trouble because Wesley Blake is no laughing matter. Wesley Blake is destroying these so-called contenders in, my, in this Fatal 4-Way. And then I gotta go through some guy who thinks he has this theory that he's the greatest of all time. I, I don't know. I don't know. I beg to differ. I might be the greatest of all time. Yes, I don't have any championships around my waist. But I will prove it to you at Stardom Saga 26. Yes, I haven't won the Fatal 4-Way yet. But you know, Wesley Blake's got this in the bag. Wesley 
No, I'm not going out. I'm going in. Wesley. Whew. Wow. Interesting. Very interesting indeed from those four gentlemen. Now with me now, Jack Gravity. Jack Gravity here. And I'm back on the scene of things. And my sister, Abigail Gravity, has a Mega Women's Championship match against Mama Hall. And Jack Gravity is going to be in the corner for his sister. And hopefully there's no shenanigans from Russell T. Morris. Because I'll end those... I'll end those shenanigans from Morris. Like zero gravity. Because no one's weathering my sister Storm because she is going to win the Mega Women's Championship. She is busy right now. She is working out, running some laps, lifting some weights. And she is busy right now. But I'm representing my sister because my name is Jack Gravity. And there's no chance Mama Hole will we come out retaining her Mega Women's Championship. No chance. My sister's got this. She is furious. She is intensity. She brings it all. And when it's all said and done, Mama Hole will not, I mean, we won't be hearing from Russell T. Moore saying Mama plays to win, yada, yada, yada. The yada, yada, yada ends and the gravity starts. The gravity era starts, and I'll get back into the scenes of things and win a championship myself. Jack Gravity, out. Wow, great words from Jack Gravity. Savage Style's still here. Um, now with me now. Tommaso, Champa, did you miss me? I'm on the staircase. There's no fox hunt going. Thank goodness. And I'm not walking around like a lunatic. Because I'm smart. Tommaso, Champa, smart. And let me tell you something. Let me tell you something straight up. And don't worry, there's enough camera footage so I don't get cut off and we don't get a part two video. Thank goodness. Anywho, Tommaso Ciampa can't wait to be the uh, Black Hole Heavyweight Champion Midnight One. I get my second chance, which should have just been my first chance, and I should have just walked out at, uh, at... It doesn't matter what pay-per-view it was. I'm making it clear. I'm taking the Black Hole Heavyweight Championship away from midnight one and giving myself my time to shine. Goldie comes back to me and I am your going to be your new black hole heavyweight champion. <laughs> no one will survive when I'm the black hole heavyweight championship. I'll give opportunity but I'll be a better champion than Midnight One. Tommaso, out. What's up? Savage Shell back. Now with me now. Now with me now. Edgar Stalling. Edgar Stalling's here. And I'm not going to stall. I'm not going to stall this video any longer. I'm just going to make it plain and simple. Eckert Stone's 1-0 and gets his first pay-per-view match against Bruno Whiskers, who I get to fight again. And Eckert Stone's is going to show him that Eckert Stone's 
means business. And Edgar Stalling is going to go 2-0. I'm done. You could take away, the, you could take the camera back, Savage Show. And that's all we have for today. Thank you, Savage Nation. Thank you, Savage Nation. You guys are awesome. You keep me going. You keep me inspired to do more. Thank you. What's up? 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 Two, three. What's up? What's up? What's up?